He wants a fame and fortune, scores of fans, multiple marketing items were made in his image. All this led to enormous wealth and power. Actor Paco, the Taco Bell star, was once the top dog. After multiple scandals which led to his firing from a top marketing campaign, Paco is now friendless, penniless, and toothless in a nursing home for former animal stars. The director of the Taco Bell commercials explains what it was like to work with Paco. He was a nightmare to work with, always making demands and he had quite a temper. He even assaulted me once, causing me great physical harm and ridicule. It took me weeks to recover. That dog is nuts. He deserved what he got. I caught him sniffing my girlfriend Trixie's butt. Trixie, an independent movie star and stripper, explains. He was a cross-dresser and a freak in the sack. And he was the one that couldn't keep his nose out of the other bitch's backsides. Trixie was the love of my life, and she enjoyed getting my big burrito every night. The fight with the director and the breakup with Trixie was the beginning of the end. Spiraling into chronic drug use and depression, Paco even alienated longtime buddy 7 and Pictures star Major the Wonder Dog. Once best friends, these two don't even talk anymore. When contacted, Major had no comment. That prick! He was just jealous that all the beaches wanted me and not him. I was America's favorite fast food star. I deserved all the fame, fortune, and women. Now alone and completely insane, Paco will live the rest of his life in this nursing home with only his memories of what was and what could have been.